Hi everyone, welcome to Better Creating. I run this YouTube channel as a means of trying to find a more simplified and productive creative life. I set myself the challenge recently of building a professional level studio that fits in a backpack. And well, this might just be the missing link. It's tiny, I mean, look at it. Let's go on a trip. I'm in Barcelona this week uh, on a creative project. The perfect opportunity to talk to you about a few of the things that people have been asking me to talk about on the channel, which is the systems and processes I use to create these YouTube videos in a productive way. As with any activity, for me, choosing the right tools uh, and not overwhelming yourself with kit is a great way to stay intentional in your work. Before I show you what's in this backpack, let's talk a little bit about the thing I'm using here as a monopod. The KNF Concept Carbon Fibre Tripod. KNF sent me this to review, but these opinions are very much my own. Well, first of all, it's tiny and super lightweight due to its carbon fibre construction. And despite its super low weight, look at that, I found it to be pretty stable to use. It comes with a very nice carry case, but to be honest, it packs easily without it and takes even less space. And comparing it to the nearest competitors on spec, this tripod is a no-brainer. Setting up involves these pull and push clips, which I really like, they're nice to use, and all metal and feel really well made and premium. There's three positions, so you can get it super low down as well. The tripod actually extends pretty high uh, with this great additional extension on the central column. Okay, we are in the debate here on clips or screw leg adjusters for tripods. I've always been a clip person, but now these do seem to keep the size down. They are great for unfolding all at once, uh, but really annoying uh, if you want to tighten one at a time and actually use the tripod. But each their own, and I actually found these to be easier to use than I expected. The detachable leg they offer on the tripod is actually like a mini monopod and doubles nicely as well as a useful vlogging tool. And I found the pan dial and ball head to be super smooth and easy to use uh, for some simple, if not perfect, uh, movement in video. One area I think KNF can improve is the feet of the tripod. They're a little bit plasticky for me and lack grip compared to the other more rubberized versions that they've released in the past. Definitely not a deal breaker. And as I say, there isn't really a better tripod for the money in this category. Pro results, high build quality and serious value for money. You can use the link in the description for a discount at KNF Concepts website. There's even a handy bag hook to keep your belongings safe. And on that note, let's get back to the hotel room and I'll show you what makes up my YouTube studio that fits in a backpack. I got a cheap camera bag off Amazon to put everything that involves my camera in. And that includes holding the Rode Wireless Go 2 and the Rode Lav Mic that keeps sound clean and flexible, and most of all, very tiny. My trusty Fuji X-T4 is the perfect package for hybrid video and photos and to get thumbnails and footage looking buttery. I recently bought the 16-55 2.8 Fuji lens, by far the best single lens I could find for the system for autofocus performance. It's all you need for this kind of work. This great variable ND filter, also from KNF Concept, is a must for getting video settings dialed in in brighter light. This magic arm by Small Rig is a great accompaniment to my KNF Concept tripod, and attaching either a mic or a small light to this is a brilliant way to create a portable YouTube system. This Rode Interview Go is great to combine with wireless Go's for a more traditional uh, boom mic if you want to get cleaner voiceovers, it's great too. If I'm traveling, I'll tend to use natural light to light videos, but I have this little aperture portable light if I really need a little bit extra for a light from behind or a key light. I edit and create everything for this channel on my iPad, notably using LumaFusion. Uh, it's in this pack and smooch, rather lovely bag that I got off Etsy. And inside I've also got a SanDisk Extreme Pro SSD, this hyperdrive uh, port to connect everything. And you'll also never find me without these excellent noise cancelling headphones from Sony. They double up both as monitoring for sound when you're recording and for editing. Hit the like button, leave a comment. That is the end of the video. Make sure to check out more of these on more stuff around productivity and creative life. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already and turn on those bell notifications. I'll see you in the next one.